Uh, MD the Diet has a question. What is the best approach for version control, Git or SharePoint? And there's also a, uh, there's going to be, I saw another question out there. I don't, I'm not seeing it get summarized also, but it was about source control as well. Um, so, so let's talk about source control for a minute. Um, the, the best approach for version control. So the way version control works today is that, um, you can't, the, the Power BI desktop file is just a binary file, right? So you, you can't do, when most people talk about version control, they're talking about, I want source control on the model. I want it on maybe the Power Query stuff as well as the report itself, right? So you can't break out those components from a source control perspective. And so what you're left with is the Power BI desktop file. Now the recent items with tabular editor and some of the external tool usage that does allow you to potentially script out the data model and source control that. Uh, but there are some limitations on what you can do from a write back perspective. So be aware of that. Uh, but in general, we're talking about the binary file of the PBIX. And so a lot of folks say to go with the SharePoint route and or OneDrive, it's kind of the same thing because then it's got the, the version control on the PBIX and you can do the PBIX integration with a given workspace as well. Git works as well, uh, but just know that you've got to handle uh, the Git items and merging and all of that. So it's, but it's a binary file. And then that would be the same the if you did it on Azure DevOps as well. Do what? The merging would be the challenge since it's a binary, right? Yeah, you can't do a merge. Be, yeah, 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 yeah. So you gotta be careful with that. Yeah.